Hey guys, welcome back. I'm Eric Shoji, professional volleyball player and libero for Team USA. I'm here to react to and analyze different volleyball matches from around the world in hopes of inspiring, educating, and having fun with volleyball nerds just like me from all over the world. So if you love volleyball just as much as I do, subscribe to my channel so you can see my videos every week. All right, guys, I hope you're having a great day. Today is pretty much cloudy and wintry and cold, but you know like that weather where the snow falls, but then it kind of melts and it's dirty and slushy and your shoes get all dirty and it's wet? That's what's going on outside. Not my favorite winter weather. It doesn't matter. It's okay. I'm excited to watch some volleyball. Today we're going to be watching Italy against China from the 2018 Women's World Championships. Such a great match. The semifinal, fifth set. Two of the best players in the world going up against each other, Zhu Ting and Paola Igonu. I'm excited to watch. Let's get into it. All right, let's go. Overpass, first point. Oh, she got to put that away. Two overpasses. First one she didn't put away. The setter was front, so the setter could block her. So as a front row hitter, you really need to be aware of where the setter is at. If they're front row, maybe you want to pass that ball. If they're back row and you can spike it, absolutely crush that ball. Jeez, there's Ting. I mean, Italy tried to rotate, make some defense on her. She just went high hands. Nice pass, did you guys see that angle? Great block though, let's watch that angle again. Pause, let's go frame by frame here. She's earlier with her angle drops that left shoulder, her right foot is behind her left foot, and is so solid all the way through that pass. Great job there. One thing about China that people don't really recognize is that they are so tall. I think they're the tallest team in the world. That's what the USA women say, and they're just really, really great volleyball players and also just so tall and athletic. What an angle again. I mean, I'm not going to go through that one. What a solid pass. Caught her a little high. Oh, they're bringing Ting in on that inside ball and Italy is not adjusting to it. That was a little bit of miscommunication. You could see the defenders kind of looking at each other. Fifth set. I understand it's hard, but you just gotta go. Nice serve. Again, Italy is passing really well. There's a Gonu over the... What a dig. What happened? I didn't even see what happened. Why didn't they convert this? Look at that dig, full sprawl. Oh, it just got a little bit tight for the middle. Great speed. <laughs> the layout dig. What a rally. and the sharp cross to end it. These are two incredible defensive teams. I mean, Asian teams are always known for their defense, but Italy is matching them dig for dig. All right, Agona serve. She has a nasty jump serve. Oh, Jinx, sorry. And here's Ting serving now. She's, I think she's the best player in the world. It's up for debate, she's gnarly. What a dig on that back row hit. Wow, Italy, there are some holes in that block, but luckily they got the block there. Yep, going after Ting, the best player. Misconnection in the middle. Nice cover middle, she's ready. What? They called a double hit on someone. I'm not sure who it was. The standing gnarly float serve. There's a going out of the back row. Middle's playing some defense. What? China just not over the net a little bit on that block. 
That was a great up by the middle. I love when middles play defense. Interesting here that Ting is not passing. She's an outside, but they're bringing their opposite into pass instead of her. Okay, gnarly float serve. Italy with the block again. All right, so China sub their outside and Ting is to in to pass now. Let's see if they serve her. Yep, knew that one was coming. Kind of threw the server off. Those things can happen. Tough serve in that seam. I feel like she's hit that spot three times now and Italy hasn't gone for it. Like they literally haven't gone for it. There we go, such a solid pass. Great swing from Ngonu on the opposite. You can see China's blocker kind of reached out to her left, opened up that seam just a little bit for her to sneak it through. Let's see where this serve goes. I think it's going down the line. Oh no, they switched it up and got kind of an overpass. Go! There's some weird plays here. All right, 8-7 Italy at the switch. Oh, lefty on the outside. Gets it down the line. Lefties are usually pretty good at that if they're swinging from the outside. They just have that wrist away. And if you don't take the line all the way, you're probably gonna get tooled. Italy with the challenge. Italy lost the challenge, 8-8. Eight, eight. Ah, a little bit late with her platform. Let's watch that one again. Pause, let's go slow-mo. So she gets her angle together in her midline, but the ball ends up on her right. So maybe she could have formed her platform on her right side instead of bringing it on the midline out. You can see she kind of gets caught late on the right side of her body. What? Wait. Great high ball set. Oh, she just missed it. Oh. I don't know what to say. I mean, that was a pretty far high ball set. I'll leave it at that. Great hand pass. Okay, and then she crushes the next ball. So clearly she shook that one off. So I think this player serving, her name is Bosetti, I think. She's a smaller outside. I think she's like 5'10", like 180 centimeters. Great up, that's what she does. She's so steady. Look at that. That's why she's in the lineup. Another swing for Ting. Three digs and one rally for her. Woo! Let's see that again. Watch her positioning. She's right outside the block. Gets balanced. Great move to her left. These rallies are exhausting to just watch. Four digs. And Italy puts it away. I mean, that was incredible defense. Bosetti, who's short, just such a steady player. She's in there for ball control to keep Italy together in the back row. And she, that's exactly what she did on that rally. Oof, that deep swing. She didn't bring it down the last time that Italy Libero dug it because it's Tink kind of brought it down and that time she ripped it to the corner. And if you're kind of shallow and playing for that short ball, that deep ball is gonna be very hard to get. Caught her high. Oh, let's watch that block. Slow-mo, Ting gets over. 
actually kind of reaches to her left, but her head is above the net. Stuffed straight down. Woo! She wanted to play that one. Nice eye, libero. I think she's considered one of the top liberos in the world, so I shouldn't be surprised that she let that go. Okay, with that pass. Wow, she is so shallow on defense. Great swing. Again, deep corner. China kind of moved up. Hitting that deep corner is going to be really, really effective. That pass was picture perfect, by the way. Her shoulders were forward. She didn't lift up on contact. Stayed solid. Angle was great. Enough said. Another inside. <laughs> Can we watch that again? I don't even know how, what, who, when. She actually dug it. It just went directly into the center. Maybe they like that inside set because it gives her a lot of range. I don't know, to me it just seems like you're not making the blockers work. Just less range for the middle to cover. Didn't quite, quite get her angle around. Great play. Little confusion. Was that a block? That was a block. A big block. Dang, China with the free ball to go up 13-12 and they couldn't convert it. But that was a smart play by number 17 on Italy. She kind of just put in the middle. A little bit of confusion with the setter and they couldn't get the best hit out of it. And going with this jump serve. Dang. That went to like the 15 foot line. Holy crap. Like you can be in the right spot feeling great about yourself. But if there's a serve that just dies right in front of you, you can't do much about it. Especially at that pace. <gasps> Match point number one for Italy. And going to serving again. There's no one in area one right now. No, that, ah, but I think she has to go for it. Match point number two for Italy. Okay, we need to watch that pass again. This is just great technique, so steady. Frame by frame, takes a little hop. Gets in a great position, angles out, shoulders are forward. Do you guys see how forward her shoulders are? Lifts up just a little bit, but not much, not enough to affect the pass. And just creates a great angle. Agonu. No, she flailed it out of bounds, no spin. Dang, that back row pipe sort of thing. 14 all. There we go. That was early on your right side. Another pipe. Just blasted it off the high hands. Why isn't China like in a better spot on block? Like every ball is going to her. They haven't set that outside more than one time this set. Match point number three. Great up. She's so shallow, but in a great spot because she's so quick. Not another error on match point. She's getting so many sets. How many sets is that this set? This game, this set. 15 all. Wow, that served down the line. I am baffled. I mean, these are incredible swings by Agonu, but China is not adjusting their block. This is a bump set and their middle blocker is late. As if I know what I'm talking about in blocking, but come on, they should have almost three blockers up on this girl, on this player. Are you serious? Match point number four.
okay, okay with that serve down the line. These serves, <laughs> no, I don't want any part of them. Middle's playing defense. Great free ball pass. Nice up by Agonu. It's going to her. Boom, high off the hands. The digger misses it. Can we watch that block again? Maybe I'm not giving enough credit to Italy and Agonu, but these are gnarly shots. But the block is late. I don't know. I'm not sure. Wow. 17-15 in the fifth. What a set by Italy. They really, really grinded that set out and went on to the finals of World Championships. What a match. Wow. What a match. What a set. A five-setter in the semifinals of a World Championships is what you want to see in volleyball. So congrats to Italy for a match well played. They went on to the finals against Serbia for the World Championships. Two things. The first is that I am obsessed with all-around volleyball players. Italy's two outsides are on the smaller side, but are still competing at the highest level because they can pass, they can play defense, they can serve. And it's a lesson for all young players out there. Learn the entire game, learn how to pass. Even if you're small, don't let that deter you from wanting to go pro, wanting to be on the national team. If you can pass, you can play. The second thing is, I know I was a little bit harsh on China's block and I really shouldn't be considering I don't block. <laughs> and also that they're number one and have pretty much won every tournament out there. But considering Egonu scored like 40 points in that match, they probably should have had a better block up in that fifth set. But you live and you learn. I'm sure they're probably gonna get better and smash everyone in the next tournament. <laughs> anyway, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Have a great day. Get out, play some volleyball, have some fun, and I'll see you all soon. Peace.